quick video is going to show you how to complete and turn in an assignment in Google Classroom. So probably the number one thing you're going to hear from your teachers when it comes to Google Classroom is submitting an assignment that they've given you in Google Classroom and completing it and making sure that you've turned it in. And it's super easy to do. So the first thing you want to do is make sure that you're in Google Classroom and that you're in the class that you want to be in and you go to the Stream tab, which is the one with all of the events in it, just like that. Now, the assignment for the day should probably be probably the first one up here at the top. And you can see right here, I've got the world's easiest homework assignment and it's marked as not done. So this is what I want to complete. And I'm going to do that by clicking on the title. And then if your teacher has attached a worksheet like this, you're just going to click on it and it's going to open up in a new tab. Now, let's say just for a second that your teacher hasn't created this document, but he or she wants you to create a document and submit it to the assignment. It's super easy to do that too. You just go to the Create tab and you click on the type of file that you need to create and it'll create one for you and automatically attach it to the assignment. So if your teacher says, hey, I want a slideshow about your biography project you're reading or whatever, you would go ahead and click Slides and it would create a slideshow for you. Um, you can also, let's say that you've created something on your home computer and it's a PDF or something like that in your drive, you would click the Add button and you can either add a file directly from your drive if it's already done or attach it with this right here. So there's a couple of different ways to add something to this. But for this, your teacher's already created this awesome, easy assignment for you. So you're gonna click on it and of course you're gonna fill it in. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish this assignment. And everybody knows that 10,566 divided by six is obviously 1,761, duh. So that's all done there. Now, once I filled out the questions, that doesn't mean it's, a, it's submitted. This is the important part. You have to submit it. And there's two ways to do it. You can either click the turn in button in the top right corner here, or back here, you can hit the blue turn in button, which is what I'm gonna do. And it says, would you like to submit? And I'm gonna go ahead and click turn in. Only then does it actually count as turned in. And something you also want to remember is if you've submitted an assignment and you've got the little done button right here, and if I go back to my stream, you'll see that it's done. I can't edit this unless I unsubmit it first. So it's kind of like once you've clicked the turn in button, it's like putting it on the teacher's desk. And if you want to do something to it, you have to take it off of the teacher's desk by hitting the unsubmit button in order to edit it again. Does that make sense? That's pretty much it. And then once you've made your changes, you can go ahead and turn it again. And there you go. So super simple to do, but really important that you hit that turn in button and that when you finish the assignment that you see it saying done here. If you do not see this, it means the teacher probably doesn't have it.